welcome back this is today's farm we proceed by getting our female fish uh, after preparing your pretty tube gland set is ready the next thing is to inject your female fish now uh, you can use instead of pretty tube gland you can use any other hormones uh, you can use overprim you can use PPT there are different products uh, and there are some um, you can also use cow urine it has been tested and is okay working perfectly but I prefer prostitute gland because to me is more natural than using overprim or any other one. Now, before you inject your fish, you make sure uh, you use a wet towel to pick it up and hold it down. Now, there are several places where you can inject your fish. Now, some you say angle 45, you, you inject towards the head side some towards the abdomen side some um, beneath the skin today uh, I'm going to inject two fishes so the first one I'm going to inject it towards the the egg side now normally I inject from this side I don't normally let it get to the head completely immediately after this thing I do my injection so what I do is I just move a bit up gently pierce it in and gently release it gently 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 now you can do both sides because some people believe the eggs but the egg bags are two that's so that both are okay But after ingestion, make sure you rub your fish very well. Massage it very well. Massage it very well. You can now return it back to the pool. Very active fish. Very active female. Now, this particular female, I'm going to eject it from this side, beneath the skin. Beneath the skin. So, this is how I'm doing it. Watch carefully. You can do it both sides. Massage your fish gently, gently, 
and return them to the pond. Now we're going to wait for seven to eight hours. Today weather climate is about 29 degrees Celsius here where we are. So after seven, eight hours, our fish should be ready for spawning. See you then.